So anyway, I hope this continues on. I don't think it did, but anyway. Um, so this is Tit's cage. She's got it. Got the blanket down for the night. There's a big window behind her and a window on the end. She's in the slide out of the dining room. And then down here, we have Nell on her bed and a little bit of storage under the tables. And Stevie on his bed. He's got his teddy bear there. Not that he likes it. I'll have to move it because he doesn't like it there and he won't move it. So anyway, Tit has quite a nice uh, thing. I think these are 32 inch. They're either 32s or 42s. One is, I think this one is a little bigger than the other one. I don't know why the, the single cat got the bigger kennel, but it just what happened. Anyway, this one has two doors. And this one over here only has one door. And in the corner... Titten is sitting on my Christmas and birthday present from Dawn and Richard, and thank you. It worked beautifully. It is a lovely piece of furniture with a wicker basket on the top, a curved arm to hold it up, and even a scratching post. I don't know if you can quite see the scratcher in the corner. Hey, there's the scratcher in the corner down there behind the behind the guy hanging up there to be playing with. So anyway, Tit's sitting or Titten is sitting in the basket. Here's Lucy. She's sitting on the box, the bed box, so somebody can be in the bed box, somebody can be in the basket, and they stay warm. The towel on, or the red blanket on top is just to give it so that they can keep some heat radiating down. Just lie down, Skeet, you're fine. There you go. I'll move the bear. There you go. Now you can lie down. So anyway, that's our dining room area there in the, in the slide out. Lots of storage up top, all the way around. And uh, we don't have any easy chairs in this one. This is a, a like a futon type sofa. Folds out, the bottom comes forward, and the back goes down. Uh, anyway, and there's storage underneath. Uh, nice picture windows behind uh, dining room and living room, and a huge picture window in the back here. Anyway, so then this is a single kennel here for the two cats. Uh, for a while, I, the reason we have two kennels is because I had to have both Skeet and BJ in kennels when we first got here. And we were keeping the other, the, these two cats here in the bathroom. Oop, the furnace went off. And uh, then uh, we kept Tit in this rabbit cage over here. Uh, but we've now put the cats in the bigger kennels because they're, the, the dogs are in here so many hours a day, it's kind of hard to keep them in one of those kennels. But uh, Ruby, come down here, hon. Come on, hon. You can come down here with Mom. So anyway, uh, this is Bee's new area because for some reason she decided that she was going to fight with Nell non-stop. So she has her new area we had to devise last night. So I had forgotten that these kennels come with a dividing thing, so it's now a gate. So we did a little bit of innovative movement last night and got that sorted out. So she's actually on what's supposed to be Skeet's bed, that's Skeet's mattress, because he doesn't really care for these big pillows. But anyway, you can see he's quite warm. It's very, it's keeping up with the heat. Mind you, today we seem to have a Chinook wind, so it's pretty hot outside in comparison to what it's been. And here we've got our, our uh, buckets for uh, litter pellets and feed and whatnot. And there is the back door with a nice window beside it too. Anyway, so there is our trailer and this is how we've managed because my sisters are all allergic to my animals and my animals are my livelihood. So we had to figure out a solution and boy, I'll tell you, it created quite a stir with my sisters and brother-in-law how I was going to manage this. I did do it basically on my own with a little bit of help from some wonderful men around here, Alex, their handyman, and Dwayne from the trailer place, and uh, it's worked out quite well. The trailer's not situated where I want it, but we'll move it in the spring once the snow is gone and the ice is gone so that we can actually manipulate it into the place where we need it to be. Unfortunately, the snow plows had not properly cleared the street, and so we couldn't get it kind of pushed where we needed to so anyway we ended up it was lots of room we probably even could have gone with about a six foot shorter and still managed but it would have been pretty darn tight so anyway there's our trailer there's our new home away from home which sounds like we're going to be using a lot of unfortunately my sister's health is is uh, not the best and 
if I need to or want to spend time with her, this is how we have to go, but these kennels will also work for Ruby's Pops and, and our new baby pop, the baby that hasn't been born yet. We're still waiting for our next uh, Cavalier Pop to be born, so that's where we are, and Ruby's being so good waiting on the bed, aren't ya? You being a good girl? She says, I want to go in, Mom, and take my coat off. It's hot with this on. Anyway, we're going to say goodnight, and I hope you have a really good week. I'm not going to post this until after I'm home, after the 29th, when all the legal stuff is taken care of, and somebody has gone to jail for the uh, crimes he doesn't believe he committed, even though the evidence is overwhelming, and his relatives think that he's totally innocent of anything, and... After all, all I have to do is give his guns back and everything will go away. Thanks, Trudy. And if I was a dutiful wife, if my husband came home and told me he didn't love me anymore, I should just do the honorable thing and pack my bags and leave. Thanks a lot, Elizabeth Harder. Anyway, here we go. So I'm going to say goodnight. Say goodnight now. Yeah. Say goodnight, Rube. Say goodnight, Tit. Say goodnight, Tit. Meow. 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 Say goodnight, Skitty Dog. Oh, the tail's going. Hey, Luke. Say goodnight, Lucy. Say goodnight, Tit. Meow. Meow. Hey, B. And say goodnight. Say goodnight, B. Say goodnight. Yeah. Goodnight, everybody. There's the tail. And you guys, I hope you enjoyed our, our video from Walt to Walt Border Collies and coming up, Colin Cavaliers with our King Charles Spaniels and uh, all our little kitties from Walt to Walt Apartment Kitties. And we'll talk to you later. Oh, by the way, BJ has some surprises coming up in February for us all, don't you, BJ? You got surprises for everybody? Huh? My good girl, you got surprises? Yeah, you say wait. Stay tuned to see what's coming after Valentine's. We got surprises for everybody. Good night. <laughs>